stubby. It's Morning. still dark. There is downtown Seattle. That what is that city over there? Down the, uh, that's oh, like Ballard. 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 So this is uh, my view in the morning when I used to come in in the morning. But today we're going to the airport, and then right here I would see all these pretty lights because it's like six, almost six o'clock in the morning. You see the pretty lights. And then overlooking to the left, once you go up to this bridge, you are able to see the pretty sights of downtown Seattle with um, with all the buildings and um, there, like early morning lights. See, there it is. There's Space Needle right there. There's Hubby Hubby. What did we do? We, we got bumped. We got bumped. To First earlier class. flight. Oh, and earlier then to what? First class. <laughs> and then it's outside. I've never been outside. I told Hubby's like, this is my first time where I have to be out feeling the... This is the first time we flew on a flight together with no kids. Oh, that's right. Ever. 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 <laughs> Ever. <laughs> well, still, that's why I like morning flights. You're able to... There's more rooms into the morning flights. Then you're able to move around. Plane. I'm a scarred. Actually, I'm very scared. I don't like to fly. <laughs> I don't like to fly. And it's red cup season. All right, so how much was Uber gonna cost us? Probably around 40 bucks. 40 bucks, okay. How much is public transportation gonna cost us? 10, 10 bucks all day. All day, $5 each. Mm -hmm. Hubby is all about um, public transportation. So we are going to take Beaverton from Portland Airport. And Portland Airport right now it's cloudy, rainy, and I got my boots on. Well, they actually messed up on my order because I couldn't use my um, I couldn't use my my phone app and receive my twelve dollars that I spent uh, points. So they gave us an extra lemon loaf, which was really nice of them. So here's a train. My first time on a public train. I'm excited. I told hubby I've never been on a train like this. Oh, it's not one I saw. Yeah. <coughs> it's like um. It's like those shows or the movies that you see that people ride the subway over in New York. And he's eating my breakfast. I thought I'm hungry. I asked for extra hot. It's extra hot. I like it. Look, public transportation. Oh, yeah. Alright, so we are in Portland. And then you guys see the little scooters right there? Riding along. We got off the train. Oh. <laughs> we got off the train. So we have like an hour. Is it an hour before Nike opens? Yeah, well, actually, it's like, um, yeah, an hour. An hour. So we're going to go walk around and go to uh, Voodoo Donuts because it's like two blocks away. Voodoo Donuts. Hubby just had Starbucks. This is why I can't get sexy. Hubby and I like to eat. <laughs> so we're going to go get a Voodoo Donuts and then we are going to go take the blue. Blue train, blue blue, blue train. line. Yes. I've so, never taken it. So blue line to be able to um, go into the Nike store. And then how long is that? Like three, three? 
another 30 minutes. Another 30 minutes. <gasps> Yay! Right? So I'm like walking around and I'm like, ooh, a Willy Wonka. I go, Willy Wonka, what is that? And then I'm like, oh, it's Sticky Wonka. And I'm like, hubby, it's, what's that? It's a gentleman's club. Oh, dear <laughs> Lord. <laughs> I thought it was Willy Wonka. I'm like, oh, that's a different look for Willy Wonka Chocolate Factory. <laughs> I love it. Portland. Portland. It's almost like a Vegas. <laughs> Downtown Portland. Walk like, what, five minutes? Five minutes. Five minutes. There it is, Voodoo Donut. And then over here, I think it's that one is where they have the Saturday market. So you just walk that way and then um, a few times we've been here, we... We like to come to Portland. Um, we go there for um, to stop by and see the the market. And uh, Portland, downtown Portland, is not where you would want to walk on a by yourself, ladies. So here is Voodoo Donut. Shall we go inside? Yeah. Yeah. All right, we got off the stop, and it's just right there. It's like yeah. what 800 feet? Yeah, 800 feet. That's not bad, but although I did have issues in the train, I would hold the pole with my sleeves. Yeah, we gotta find gloves. Because I don't want to get sick. I can't get sick, babe. I can't get, get sick. sick. So that's it. I just had to pull down my sleeves, but it was good. I wanted to take a little nap, but I just rested my eyes. And now we're um, hubby's here to look for a Seahawks military sweatshirt. Jersey. Jersey. Nike's the one that um, provides those. Whew. Do that. Um, kids don't need any more gears. And and then we're gonna go downtown and have lunch. Murder eat. You like it? Yeah. So this is the one he's getting. And then that one. Then you're just gonna get these pants. And then I wanna get this sweatshirt. They wanna get these ones. Huh? So you're gonna get that one? They're different. Back to his bus, but it's all right. The smelliest seat in the house. <laughs> <laughs> but that's okay. Because our flight was supposed to be at 7, and so we got into the, barely made it into the, which one was this, the 1245? 135. The 135. So, we're seated at the back, but we're good to go. So, thank you, Alaska. Thank you, Alaska. today it might take a couple of days for it to accumulate to one vlog but I do have Miss Danica hi Danica and I am using my phone because um, it turns out the the one the camera that I've been using with you guys for like making my sensi videos when I sit down to actually be in front of the camera is actually um, has passed on has passed on so hubby's like why don't you just use your phone you know you've been using your phone all this time so I'm gonna be using my phone and then messages are popping up but anyways I wanted to show you guys how how I go to work and it's like packing the whole house um, that seems to be the case when you got so many kids like I do I got like four kids but I have Miss Danica and she wanted to say hi with you guys <laughs> go ahead say hi sorry go ahead say hi, hi. so she's having banana 
um, dressed her nice and comfy. So her outfit of the day. Go ahead. You want to show them your outfit of the day? Nice, nice, soft. Um, I just bought her shoes. My outfit of the day is I'm wearing boots and I like a ruffled shirt. And then I'm wearing um. Uh, what do you call that? Like a long, long sweater jacket. But anyways, so Danica's backpack. I bought this at Daiso for like three bucks. Not cute. So she has her water in there. And tomorrow is picture day. So she's got her money for that. You ready for picture day tomorrow? All right. So this is my bag that I packed to work. And this is my coach diaper bag. I used this when I was doing photography. But I also do my happy planner. Um, at work when I'm not so busy. So this is for the 2019. This is actually the one that I'm gonna use for work purposes. So I'm gonna transfer everything in there. And this is the one like for family schedule with kids. And then I pack. So this whole bag right here is just nothing but happy planner. So it's pretty heavy. But I do go to work after I drop off Danica. Um, hubby works from home. And then, so I'm packing with me today all this stuff that to show you guys what I've been warming. I have been really utilizing my um, my bricks and then I wanted to show you guys the bricks I got last year. Don't mind that, that's just from outside. It rains a lot here. Um, and then all the stuff I was warming. This is my lunch bag and then I have an ice scraper here. Hubby just got an ice scraper and I need to put that into the, the car, but I have an umbrella and then I have ramen. Hi, baby. <laughs> I have ramen for myself and um, uh, one of my co-workers if they're hungry, so I always pack two. But um, this is really nice. I get this over at Business Costco. It's the udon Japanese uh, noodles. I like the noodles because they're not um, hydrated. Is that, you know, like they're dried. They're actually fresh noodles. Um, so got that. And then I got my notes. Uh, and then I got my notes and stuff in here. So are we ready to go? Okay, bye-bye to Dad. Bye, Dad. Bye, Dad. All right, friends, Trader Joe's. My, I have three Trader Joe's in my area. Yeah. This Trader Joe's, it's like chaos in parking. It's so hard to park because it's just a little small parking area, but it's popular. And I'm waiting for a spot for the guy the, or the lady to leave, right? And I'm waiting. And as she pulls out, there's this little white car that, that goes in there coming from the wrong way. So I'm like, dude, really? <laughs> and then Danica's like, dude. And then he knew he did it wrong. And I'm a sucker for people that apologizes. Because then he's like, oh, oh, I'm sorry. Did you want that? And I'm like, yeah, I kind of did. He goes, do you want me to get out? Don't worry about it. You're already out of your car on the street. There's no need to go back into your car and start up the car again. Just so you can give me the spot that I was been waiting for. It's all right. Go ahead. Go into Trader Joe's because I'm going to see you there. <laughs> so, all good. I got this one. It's better anyways. So, good thing comes to those who are patient and kind and who wait. All right. So, let's see you at uh, Trader Joe's. Yes, my love. Let go. Oh, you need... Is it private or can our friends hear? I love you more. <laughs> she always says I love you. I love you more. You're my best friend. Oh, I love you so much. So much. You're my favorite. <laughs> They're all my favorite. Okay, let's go. Pushing cart. We're getting the calendar. Oh, no, we don't need that. We're going to get this one. Look, Danica. I see you. I see you. Let's get this one. Let me see. Pumpkin spice cornbread croutons. You want that one? all right so just dropped off baby girl it's her picture day um uh, maybe i can insert one of the picture that i i took of her had her on pigtails and then um just a, a like a sweater i don't like to overdress my kids um during picture day i don't know um they get dressed up but it's just one of those casual dress up things or whatever they choose to wear but um <laughs> hubby finally got my glasses so i've been postponing getting glasses but it turns out that our insurance covers like $150 of the worth of the frame. And yeah, frame and then the lenses. Um, so it was like, um, and then so like at Costco, was just picking out a brand and then the guy tapped me on the show. He goes, ma'am, he goes, those are like $39.59, but um, your insurance covers like up to 150. So we have the designer brands over here. So I ended up picking, um, I wanted a coach one. Or a Burberry because of the brand. 
I know that's so sad, right? But um, I ended up uh, picking, is it Fendi? I'm not familiar. I, I am familiar with the brand, but I've never owned a Fendi. Um, but I liked it because it was black and white. So I'm going to get that. And then I'm hoping to get one of those um, peppermint pretzels, like thin, thin pretzels that um, Costco has on sale for like, I think, four bucks. So I'm going to see if I can pick that up. This is the weather that we have currently. See how it's raining? Cloudy and rain. Oh, my goodness. But I love it. It's not too cold. I still got like a thin, like thin sweater, but I love how the ground is wet, but yet I can still walk with no umbrella. Alright, so that's the one I picked out. But there was another one that I like. I think. Was it that one? But only because it was the brand. Um, and then here was the coat dress. I think this one I like too. That was green. But look at this one. Look at that pink one. I can't pull that one off. Um, this one I like too. Yeah, but it was a leopard print. So hopefully, hopefully this one works out. All right, so I got this because hubby, hubby and Jonathan, the kids love this. I like it too white chocolate and peppermint. I think tomorrow is the last day, the 15th, to be able to get this for like $4.99 for this big bag. So I got two, uh, one for hubby to hide, one for the kids um, to munch on. Yes, we hide snacks from our kids because otherwise by the time we get to it, it's gone. And this one, I've never tried it, but I love dark chocolate and love mint. $4.99 for this huge, huge bag. And then I'm just gonna keep this into my work bag. Um, for work and then I wanted to show you guys my glasses oh comes in this case and then here she is she's a beauty all right let me try it on what do you guys think how is it it's my reading glasses so I need it for driving because I can't see I can't see the, the signs on the road I'm like what does that say so now it's it's a bit clearer. I noticed that with the Costco signs. And then um, my reading. I kind of think it's crooked. Maybe my head is just crooked. Or my eyes. But I like it. What do you guys think? All right. I'm going to use it while driving to work. All right. So I need to do um, a little bit of work before I go into the office uh, for my schedule. And so I'm going to eat over here at um, l and L&L to get my lunch and dinner. So I usually get like a bowl of chicken with veggies and rice and then um, spam masubi and then I bring it to work and then I also save it for my dinner so I don't finish all of it. But I'm just looking at my glasses. It looks crooked. Like, doesn't it go like that? Is it me? Oh. Okay, there it is. I think it's my eyebrow that's crooked. <laughs> <laughs> All right, see you guys in a bit, okay? I'm hoping I have enough footage to, um, to be able to upload. If not, then see you again tomorrow.